Hello children, how are you? I hope all of you are fine. Well, in today's class, we are going to learn about the figure of a speech. First of all, I will tell you what is a figure of a speech. Children, a figure of a speech is a poetic device. Poetic device means to say it is promptly used or prominently used in poems. Why? To enhance the beauty of poetry. A figure of a speech can be classified into different categories and I am going to describe the first category of the figure of a speech that is based on that is based on resemblance and first one is simile. What is a simile? Simile is used by a poet when he wants to compare two things, two inanimate things. As you can see in the screen, it compares two different things with the help of as, like or so. For example, you can see that the first one example is there. It is said that a poetry is like an unfolding bud. As an unfolding bud, a poem is just like the same thing. In the second sentence, you are watching Maharana Pratap was as brave as a lion. Here, Maharana Pratap and his bravery has been compared to a lion. We all know that lion is famous for its bravery. In the same way, Maharan, the writer has used Maharana Pratap's bravery and compared to the bravery of a lion. So we can say Maharana Pratap was as brave as a lion is a simile. Here you can see in the screen, first of all you are watching Maharana Pratap and later on you are watching the lion. So here in the simile we came to know that and two different objects two different objects are compared in which one quality is similar okay here the bravery of maharana pratap has been compared to the braveness of a lion so when you find as like that or so in a sentence or in a poem then you must say that this is this is what this is a simile now i am coming to the next one example and that is what that is a king was wandering like a cloud here in the sentence you can find it is written a king was wandering like a cloud that means to say the wandering of a king is compared to the wandering of a cloud as you can see on the screen that how a cloud is wandering in the sky. In the same way, the poet here used the wandering of a king from a cloud. So it is a simile. Now we are coming to our next one and that is your metaphor. So what is a metaphor? Metaphor is a compressed simile. Compressed simile means what? There will be no use of like, as, as or so in the sentence or the poem, but an object will be directly compared to another one object in which at least one quality will be similar. Even you can see on the screen it is written Marana Pratap was a loin in the battle. Second one, poetry is an unfolding burn. And third one, all the world is a stage. As you can see, poetry is an unfolding bud. You can see in the screen a poetry is there in which Saraswati Vandana is written. For the first time, when you are going to read it, you are unable to understand in the first glance 
or in the first time what a poem is but gradually when you will read it again again and again you will come to know its real beauty in the same way when you see a flower in the first day as a bud you are unable to understand its glorious beauty so poetry is an unfolding bud here a poem has been directly compared to an unfolding bud without using as like or so is it so we can say that here the poet or the writer has used a metaphor to describe a poetry okay here you can see in your screen very clearly a poem has been compared to a to an unfolding bud now we are coming to our next one and that is your personification as you can see on the screen what is a personification personification has been made from the word person person means human it definition says that any abstract idea or a non living thing is personified as a human being example the first one opportunity knocks at the door but once the next one example death in the small bracket you can see corona is written lays its icy paws even on kings children personification may koi bhi inanimate object jo ki non living thing hoti hai uska aisa use kiya jata hai ki wo ek living thing ki tarah work karta hai here on the screen you are watching a figure of corona virus we are already aware that corona virus has left nobody when we talk about poor let them be poor even the kings queens princes and the great hero of our country india amitabh bachchan this corona did not spare anybody so death lays its icy paws even on kings here on the screen after the figure of corona virus you can see the figure of a king so here i see pause corona virus or the death is an abstract idea it has been used in the sentence as a human being like laying i see pause okay so we can say that here death or corona has been used as a personification i hope you must have understood this one and wait for my next video till then take care of yourself bye 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 everyone